Today, we have built an emerald and diamond base of cars. Oh! I'm currently trying to turn my car into an emerald one with a large piston and an emerald block. Mikey and JJ don't know that there is an evil monster truck between their bases. I'm not sitting around either, because with the help of a large piston and a diamond block, I'm trying to turn my car into a diamond one. The piston has now moved the diamond block onto my car. <laughs> Great, I think I did it. It's time to go upstairs. Now I can drive my very fast car, and I am sure that no one in the village has such a thing. I haven't been outside for a long time and have been sitting at my base for a long time. Some kind of strange premonition. I can't believe my eyes. There's Mikey standing next to the villagers. Yep, villagers, we came here to negotiate. I have a machine that gives emeralds. I have one condition for you. Take them as quickly as possible and attack JJ's base. I hope that you will do everything right. See you soon. Huh? Oh no, I saw that Mikey gave the villagers blocks of emerald in order for them to attack me. I need to fix this urgently. I don't want my base to be destroyed. I have diamonds, and now it's time to make a defense for myself. I will definitely need armor. <laughs> the car, give me diamonds urgently now. While I'm driving it, blocks appear. Without these blocks, I will not be able to make armor for myself, but I am very glad that now I have the opportunity to protect myself. Oh. Therefore, I have to hide in my base. It was very badly destroyed by the villagers on behalf of Mikey, but I will definitely take revenge. No one can harm me, so now I will make diamond armor and weapons for myself. I'm starting production on a workbench. I need to protect my body, legs, and definitely my head. Yeah. To do this, I now had to make diamond pants, a vest, and a hard hat for myself. But I completely forgot. I will definitely need a tree for my sword. I know that it stands not far from my base, so I ran to cut it down. I am very glad that I am doing very well and no one can stop me. Hmm. I made a diamond sword. But I won't stop there, because I want to make him enchanted. I know how to implement this, so I will now carefully put the squares so that they fit and can make every piece of armor and weapon enchanted. I need to hurry up, because an attack on my base could happen at any moment. With the help of the fact that I decided to use enchantments, my armor and weapons will become much stronger, and it will be almost impossible to break through. <laughs> I think I did everything right, and there were no problems. Soon, I will test the enchanted sword in battle, and the villagers will regret that they decided to attack me. I'm running out of the base now. I have to drive away all the attackers and prevent them from coming close to me again. I see that they are continuing the base. You better run away from me because you can't handle me. Uh oh I am so glad that I was able to beat the villagers very hard, and they finally ran away. No one would want to fight a powerful opponent like me. And now, you urgently need to rebuild your garage because it is very badly destroyed. It's all because of Mikey, and if he hadn't forced the villagers to do this to me, then I wouldn't be doing this job. But it's okay, I'll definitely get back at him. And now we need to completely restore the base. Hmm. I think it won't take me that long. The main thing is to make it the same as it was before. Some of the blocks are missing. They were left in the drawer because the face of my garage is also ruined. I'll take a few resources now and run to repair again. I am sure that I will definitely be able to fix everything. How glad I am that in such a short period of time, I was able to find the destroyed parts and practically restore them. Oh, we need to finish our work. While JJ was rebuilding the garage, Mikey wasted no time and came up with a new plan. Unnoticed by others, he met with a villager and gave him emeralds in order to get a bunch of iron blocks and pumpkins. <laughs> JAJ does not yet suspect that an attack is being prepared on his base again, and Mikey wants to make iron golems. He didn't just buy iron blocks and pumpkins. Mikey wants to win the battle with JJ again with the help of his clever plan. Great! I've finished everything! I can't believe my eyes! Mikey is driving his car here now, and the iron golems are running! He set them on me and asked them to attack the base. Ho <laughs> ho! This is very bad because the golems are much stronger than the villagers and will destroy everything faster. I'll try to bribe them with diamonds now. Golems, I'll give you diamonds. But I have one condition. 
You attack Mikey's base. Destroy everything you see there. Oh. This is your opponent, and in no case should he be allowed to remain intact. I am very glad that we have reached an agreement with you now. Watching the golem start attacking Mikey's base is incredibly fun. I can't believe it, but now the golems are completely destroying my base. I will definitely not allow this anymore, so the moment has come to destroy everyone. Ah! And now, look carefully. I'm jumping off my car, and I've already managed to destroy one golem. It won't be difficult for me to attack others because there is a sharp spike on the nose of my car! Mikey finally found a way and is really chasing one golem right now! He was able to destroy two, and it seems he's going to do the same with this one! Mikey, stop! What are you doing? I can see that you want to destroy my car! You're making a very stupid mistake. It's better not to take any chances, otherwise you'll get hurt! How is this possible? I couldn't break through your diamond sports car and lost the spike! I need to leave urgently, because I see that you want to use it against me! <gasps> Mikey couldn't even attack me properly! He's very stupid! But it's okay, because now I'm getting on my car and starting the chase! I'm sure he'll be very surprised when he sees the spike! I see him standing near his base, I'm going to hit him! Great! Mikey's really scared right now! <laughs> protect my car. She is constantly under attack and I cannot allow her to be destroyed, so I will make a huge wall of emeralds. You won't be able to drive through it anyway. I was able to defend myself, but you can't take any chances now. I will continue to build defenses. Mikey really strengthened himself very well because he made a fence out of emeralds so that he wouldn't be able to break through it for sure. But I'm definitely not going to stop. JJ is trying to break through the emerald wall that Mikey built, but accidentally broke the stake. Huh? Because of this, the most evil monster truck has now woken up. He is now fighting his way up, and is gradually trying to get out. Mikey and JJ don't know about it yet, but they're bound to run into him soon. I won't let you go to my car anyway! No matter how hard you try to break through my emerald wall right now, you won't be able to! I'm tired of listening to you. It seems the moment has come to leave, and I hope that I will be able to do it. I don't want to stay here because the attack will continue like this. I'm trying to leave and hide. <laughs> Mikey, you're not going to make it. My car is much faster, and now I'm going to show you. You're trying to take the left lane, but I'm getting closer to you. You better buckle up because I'm going to flip your car over. You've done a lot of bad things to me, and I have to take revenge. It's impossible to drive my car anymore. Help me, JJ is chasing me. I have no other choice. I have to hide somewhere in this village. I don't want to take that much risk. I got a little behind Mikey, and it seems he ran into one of the houses. I've lost track of him. I can't believe he managed to escape from me. I haven't been so angry in a long time. Ugh. Horror, I've just seen a monster truck. He has never appeared in our village and looks very scary. I'm getting uneasy, villager. Let's exchange now. Get your armor and weapons faster. I have no other choice because now the monster truck is starting to haunt me. I think the best way now is if I get in my car and try to drive away. Uh-oh. I still don't understand how I can escape from him. He is constantly following me and trying to pursue me in every possible way. The time has come to return to your base. Monster Truck is constantly driving next to me! I finally managed to get to the car, and I'm going the other way. He's definitely not going to chase me anymore, because he won't be able to catch up. I need to hide in my base so that he doesn't destroy me in any case. I have to do my best and prepare well. Ho <laughs> ho! I feel that a battle is waiting for us soon! I hope Mikey was able to survive, and he's okay. I'd better go up higher and look at my drawers. The most important thing is that we find a way to defeat him. I can't believe you came down here, Mikey. Take the blaster faster. We will attack the monster truck. Oh, okay, I'm ready. Mikey has just taken one of the most powerful weapons I had. He can only shoot correctly and hit our opponent. And now I'm upgrading my car. It will be much more secure and dangerous than before. It's time to leave, because a very difficult battle awaits us. The car looks menacing. 
Now I'm accelerating to the highest speed and starting to leave. All that remains is to go upstairs. The monster truck is nearby, and now Mikey and I will stand in front of it. I hope he managed to install a blaster on his car. Uh oh Come closer, because he's right next to us. Just be careful. It seems he is about to make the first attack now. I can't believe it, but it accelerates much faster. Run away. We can't take that risk. Oh no, he crushed our cars. I never would have thought that it would be so scary, because the monster truck does not spare anyone and is now starting to approach my base. I'll hide inside. I can't go out now. I'll wait until he leaves, and only then I'll come up with a plan how to resist him. Ho <laughs> ho! I have never been in such a situation. I think I have a very cool plan now. I will make a trap for the monster truck, and then it will definitely not attack our bases anymore. But to do this, I need to prepare very well and keep a close eye on him so that he doesn't suspect anything. I will definitely need a tool. I'm going to make a shovel now. Hmm. I need to hurry up because time is very short and I haven't even managed to enchant the tool I'm making yet. This is a must, because only with it will I be able to make a trap quickly. The idea will be that I will dig a huge hole into which I will lure the monster truck. If I prepare well now, then my plan will definitely work. Oh. The main thing is that the monster truck doesn't notice me. It seems like I did a good job, because now I'm already running out of my base. We need to run as far as possible. I am very glad that I have such a cool idea because I can use it to make a pit. <laughs> it won't take much time because I have a magic shovel. I will be able to dig much faster than usual. Then my trap will definitely work and the monster truck will fall into it. Mikey is probably hiding at his base right now and hoping that no one will attack him. But I'm definitely not going to just sit there. I think I've decided on the size of this pit. Yuck. It's time to dig deep because there is very little time left. The faster the monster truck falls, the better it will be for everyone in this village. With the help of a shovel, I get a very large pit. But this will not be enough because everyone will see it from afar. I have to make it invisible and I think I have some ideas. It remains to dig out the rest of it and finally start masking my trap. Ho oh, ho! We need to finish the trap for the monster truck. I will lure him with the help of diamond blocks because they will be visible from afar and he will surely want to take them for himself. And now it's time to arrange as much fake grass as possible. He will definitely not notice her and will surely fall into the pit immediately after that. This is the best trap I've ever come up with. Hmm. I can't take any chances because right now the security of my base depends only on this trap. We need to finish it quickly because there is very little time left. I see that I have everything ready and the fake grass is completely laid in front of the diamond blocks. Now it's time to run to your base. <laughs> I hope Mikey will help me now, so I'll try to send him a signal to look out. We must watch together what happens next. Mikey, be careful. I hope we were not mistaken, but the monster truck has really passed us now and is heading towards the diamond blocks. Let's take a closer look. I can't believe my eyes, but you still managed to trap him. Now I will try to finish him off right in this pit so that he never gets out again. <laughs> Mikey, just be careful. Surely this monster truck is dangerous. You can see what horns it has. Jump in and hit him with a sword. I'll take a good look at everything from the side. How you managed to do it is unclear to me, but it was really fun. I suggest I stop there. What have you collected there? Oh, now I have dynamite and I will definitely use it. I want to blow up your car because we are still fighting with each other. Now no one will stop me for sure. If you lose your diamond car, then you will not be able to compete with me and I will win. Mikey has gone completely crazy. He wants to blow up my car with dynamite, but I won't let him do it because I'll spill as much water as possible. I'll protect my car and I won't let you treat me like that. Oh. You will regret that you decided to blow up what belongs to me. Mikey has really pissed me off right now. The good thing is that he's out of my sight and I don't see him anymore. I think I have an idea. I will do my best to get back at him. 
Now you need to drag his flattened car away and try to lure him to you. Ho <laughs> ho! I think this way I'll definitely be able to sneak up on his base while he's trying to drag his car. Now I'm hiding and watching him closely. I don't understand how my car ended up here. Now I'm going to blow up Mikey's base. I will need a lot of dynamite in order to decompose it and then set it on fire. Hmm. Mikey doesn't even know that I'm at his base. I hope that I will be in time before he returns. I've never been so happy as I am now. It's going to be one of the most powerful explosions I've ever seen because I haven't laid out that much dynamite anywhere. We need to finish it as soon as possible because there is very little time left. I want to see the explosion as soon as possible and see what the consequences will be after it. <laughs> it seems that I managed to place dynamite in every room. You need to get back to your base faster and get a lighter in order to set it on fire. I light dynamite and run away. I can't believe it, but I did it. Mikey's base exploded. I won our battle. <laughs> That's how our incredible adventure ended.